Hello guys, uh, my name is Evans and uh, welcome back to this uh, video. In the last video, we ended on step number five and we actually were supposed to start looking at step number six, but I had to cut the video because of um, time. Okay, so with step number six, we were told to open and examine the file soundtrack um, .mp3 in appropriate editing software and we're to remove the end of the clip so that only 30 seconds remain. Okay, now this is the opposite of what we were told in the first part of the video, uh, the question where we were told to remove the first part of the video. In this case, we we're told to remove the end of the clip so that only 30 seconds remain. In other words, the first 30 seconds should remain and the, the rest of the stuff should be uh, cut off. Okay, um, rather they remove the end of the clip so that only 30 seconds. <laughs> Again, we're supposed to remove the end of the clip. This is somewhat confusing, guys. Like I said, you, you're you supposed to take your time and not just be in a rush for anything, okay? So in the last video, I did import um, the um, the video, uh, rather the audio soundtrack that we're talking about. If you, if you didn't, if you, if you're if you not familiar with that, just go to file and import and browse um, to the location where the found soundtrack is actually, okay? So what we want to do now is to remove... Um, to remove um, the the end okay let's go to the question again okay so remove the end of the clip okay the end of the clip so that only 30 seconds remain okay so the end of the clip which is the last part of the clip in this case it could be maybe this part going like this part okay up to 30 seconds like that the first second should remain okay now the part that is highlighted here, um, the part that is highlighted here is what is supposed to be removed. The part that is here is what is supposed to remain, 30 seconds, okay? So what you're supposed to do, now let me just cancel this, uh, cancel it. What you're supposed to do, uh, notice that you have, um, you have your, your timer here at the bottom of the screen. These features here are very important, guys. Okay, if you are going to use accurate uh, time, just like the trim tool that we're using in the video editing, this part is also important. Start and end of selection. Okay, so you're supposed to select the start point and the end point. Okay, so the start point is actually supposed to be um, 30 seconds. So um, again, you can set your time here what you want you can set your time like hours whatever and um, plus the hundreds so set this one because um some 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 videos um rather some soundtrack they have some milliseconds um existing so you want to make sure that even milliseconds are accounted for okay so to do that um just click on the you have the hour let me just do this again um you've got the um, the hour which is here you've got the minute which is here you've got the second which is here and you've got the millisecond which is at the best uh, at the end there the hour also here um, you've got the minute here you've got the second here and you've got this millisecond at the bottom rather at the far end there and this is where um, uh, you need to know uh, what you want to uh, cut off so in my case I want to start from position number 30 from position this one okay 30 seconds all the way to the last part okay so all the way to the last part okay let me just uh, stop this so all the way to the last part which is supposed to be okay, let me just find out the end the duration for this um for this audio file just pardon me i want to find out the duration for the audio file so it's supposed to be 59.4 okay 59.4 so 59.4 um and select this one which is 30 zero, zero. notice that this is the part that has been highlighted now in video editing the part that was highlighted is the part that was left but in our case the part that is highlighted is the part that we are cutting off okay so cut off this part and the part that remains is supposed to be 30 seconds. And notice that audio position is at 30 seconds exactly. Okay. Now, this is very important, guys. Now, the next question, the next part of the question tells you that um, after you edit the file, um, give it an appropriate fade in and fade out. Okay. So, to fade in and fade out, you need to select by how much you want to fade in. 
okay so I want maybe the first um, let's say the first um, how many seconds are these now uh, let's say the first um, five seconds to fade in not five seconds that's too much um, let's say the first um, stop it the first come on <laughs> okay let me start with the fade out so fade out fade out maybe just this much it's not good to fade out so much otherwise um again when you fade out so so soon it's it has got a sharp fade that you know it's it doesn't sound good okay so here this is the fade out okay don't switch this one so this is the fade out and you you need to have the fade in so from start position up to 19 um maybe one second yeah that's fine and this one let's make it as fade in so go to effect and fade in now notice that there is one part here which is not faded so this this part should be accounted for so i'm going to undo this and just select um from here from here and take it to the far end there and then say fade in yeah now it's faded uh nicely so try it okay yeah it comes in nicely even though it comes in very fast okay so notice let's just make it like this so that it makes more sense okay um not you don't have to fade like fade um, um over what you faded already otherwise it just diminishes completely so let's fade it let's say for five seconds maybe um uh, let it fade in going into five seconds yeah that that is that is perfectly fine um yeah that sounds very good so let's pick up five seconds also from this side from this end okay so effect um fade out and that that comes up perfectly as well okay very good next we're supposed to um we're supposed to export um add this video soundtrack where where are we <laughs> Save this audio clip as soundtrack true.mp3. Okay, so what we're going to do is to save it as an mp3 file. So what we need to do actually is to just export it. Okay, so go to um, a file and go to export and export as mp3. Sometimes you can go to export as web, okay, or export just in any audio format, but select mp3. If you do not have um, an encoder, a dedicated encoder, it won't come up as MP3. It may come up at the export audio. Just select audio and put the extension dot MP3, and your operating system is going to try to add um, that. So notice you're not supposed to add dot MP3 at the end there because why? The save type here, if file type is MP3, so there's no need for you to add dot MP3 down there. Okay, so click on save. Now notice also that um, the the file that you have. Um, you have got it's supposed to be soundtrack 2 okay so just put 2 at the end there and click on save now if you're using audacity this is the some of the the, the good part that i love about audacity um i love to add the artist name <laughs> okay so for now like i say don't do what you're not told to do just just leave it as it is and say okay okay and your file is now exported um as as that okay so let's go back to the question paper and um um step nine says add this soundtrack to your video so that they start and finish at the same time remember the soundtrack is 30 seconds and the video is actually 30 seconds as well okay so let's go ahead um and 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 do just that okay so we have um on the video here so the video is 30 seconds as you can see here it's showing is 30 seconds and the soundtrack is 30 seconds that's a perfect match husband and wife <laughs> okay so let's add the video rather the audio and um, um, so what we need to do is to um, let's see uh, add this one here so it is added and the soundtrack is actually the one in green and it is a perfect match it is just ending exactly where the other ones are ending next step you are supposed to export your video in now mm -hmm. where am i <laughs> okay so export your video in 
uh, window movie video and um, you're supposed to format with the file name color to underscore followed by your center number um, and candidate number so I'll copy this and export um, this video so export save us and for computer and just change this window media video and um, change it to um, that name but put your center number 556 and your candidate number 001 and that should be fine okay next step so let's go to here next step step number 11 says um, evidence for export or convert your video into mp4 format with a file name coral um, underscore three underscore uh, then followed by your center number and candidate number now you guys um, um, some of you you have some converters that you can use to convert this one into an mp4 format uh, alternatively you can just export it again but this time around select to export it in mp4 as opposed to export, uh, exporting it into the um, the WMV format, okay. So um, just say close and go to file again, and this time save for high definition display, and make sure that it is MPEG4 here, and um, um, paste your, the name um, ZM. So it's supposed to be ZM five 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 six underscore um, zero 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 one, okay. And that's the name of of that okay so once it done uh, it's done exporting um, then you are good to go okay so that would mark the end of um, step uh, number or rather the audio and video editing uh, section of paper 2 and the next section that we're supposed to start looking at is the spreadsheet section and um, so I'll see you in the next video which probably I'll upload in the next um, <laughs> tomorrow okay so for today i think i'll just end here because i have a class um with um with some students for online tuition so uh, like i said guys i'm running online tuition so if you want um uh, me to tutor you um please just get in touch with me you can send me a message or you can whatsapp me <laughs> i've put up a number i don't know somewhere <laughs> Okay, but the number is a number somewhere that you can use to WhatsApp me or email me or just comment out your email and I'll, I'll on this video and I'll get in touch with you. Remember these videos are rather this tuition they are for all the IT um the IT um the papers um paper one, paper two, paper three, paper four, so which is AS or A two, computer science also Paper one, paper two, paper three, paper four, which is um, AS, A2. And then you have got the, for the IGCC, ICT, paper one, paper two, paper three, and for the computer science, paper one and paper two. All these papers I'm offering for tuition um, um, at a fee. Okay. So get in touch with me, and I'll see you shortly in the next video.